We're back in the ski or well, hopefully we meet Eddie soon. I'm excited to meet Eddie. Eddie! The fat guy. You can't just eat pizza! <laughs> Eddie, that kills people. But I'm crazy. He is fucking crazy. <laughs> Eddie's the cliffy of this game. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it's just a static box. It's locked. Damn, dude. Kick it! Is it all static? No. Oh, I just killed it straight up. That's badass. That's what You're they call real cool. Thanks, man. I try, bud. <clears throat> I'm glad you try. I'm glad you rye. Bread. Does anyone actually like rye bread? Old people. I actually don't mind what rye bread, but not for sandwiches. A lot of people think it's like a great sandwich bread. I don't agree with that. I have never had rye bread. It's very, uh... It's hard to explain the flavor. You'd have to try it. Have we been here? I can't tell, because our map's all fucked. We're, we're on the... Yes, we have been here. So that's a safe. So we've been to this floor. So we have to go up another floor. I got all lost and confused, folks. This, is, this apartment building is literally, in my opinion, the most confusing part of the game. Mm -hmm. uh, other than the the prison's kind of weird, but that's because it has like a an old Bowser level trope. If I could just oh, have lava, no. <laughs> the fireballs, right? <laughs> no, um, you know when like you... oh wait, I found the map. Aha! Hey. No more being lost for me. All right, let's see what we got here. Old man, look at my wife. I'm a lot like she was. Alright, so this is where we jump over. Big red square. Clock tower. Clock towel. Uh, we went in there. Because that's where... What was in there? I don't know. Really? I don't know. That's where the saving is, and I believe where the uh, right, 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 you damn well right, 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 you bloody well right, right, you want the right, what's all this thing? You got the right to say, so there's a way to get into that pool area, but that red square, that's the save point, oh, yeah. Hmm. So literally every area of room in that area is just, no. Yeah, except for 109. Yeah. Try 109 one more time. Maybe we got a key and we just didn't realize. Okay. Maybe we're a bunch of big fucking dum-dums. We could check and see if we have any keys. I think it's the other way. I'll just check the map. Yeah. 105. Wait, 109's open, you said too? Oh, yeah, Maybe. Maybe the ointment opens it up. I'd also check this room. Better. I think there's just a first aid kit in here or some shit. Yeah. I got all mixed up again, so I'm gonna check. Yeah, it got turned around. It's hard to not, Dylan. You have to admit, that was a I'm confusing... I'm the map master. I that, never lose my way. That was nothing. Okay, I killed you, sir. See? See how you can just fucking... Do, do, do. Is the 109 here? No. Dylan... It's the first fucking door on the left. Okay. Wait, why does it say he's holding it? The person on the other side. Could you open it, sir? Maybe there's something that... Something must have opened somewhere else, though. So we're gonna go back across to the old apartment. Something's opened over there, I think. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. No, I'm saying... Give me a kiss, boy. That sounds fake. You want a kiss? You know... No. Sure. Get away from here. You like it when I kiss you hard? No. Again, you know what I should do? Check if I've got a key anywhere. Because <laughs> we haven't checked it. Because sometimes I just pick shit up. True. Uh, so we got the radio. We got a photo. Want to look at this photo of Mary? No. There she oh. is. Oh, uh, God. Why are we coming here for this? <laughs> well, uh, old man coin, six healings, two first aids. Nothing. I can't remember what means we're almost dead. <laughs> oh, you know, there'll be, like, the the lifeline. No, that's Resident Evil. <laughs> pranked. You want to get pranked? How about I suck your dick? 
Yes, please. Mm. Sorry. Just, Jesse sucks Dylan's dick, and everybody has a good time. Except for Dylan. Because it was awful. And now he's now he likes boys. Oh shit, Dad. Mom, I like boys now. Get out of my house. Because I'm gay. No, I just... Get out. Get a job. Fucking homeless. I have a job, Mom. Stop calling me a fucking homeless. Why don't you pay me rent? I do. It's not a lot. Give me a kiss, Mums. <laughs> <laughs> do you ever say that to your mom? No. Give me a kiss, Mums. Uh, oh, yeah, I love you. I fucking love you, miss. I love you. Alright, let's see what we got here. So we have a gun now, which is something we don't think about a lot in life. Yeah. We got that. I don't know why it's circling like it's still something to do there, because there's not. It's not something to do there. The... The clock? Yeah, I'm going to go up to the clock room and check out over in that area some more, because I feel like I rushed out of there when I got the orange juice. I was like, fuck yeah, orange oh, juice. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> I got a gun now, so who's going to stop me? You? <laughs> Make it Satan. Oh. Th that, those bars actually kind of set me off. I always think there's something there and there's never anything there. One time I was playing... Uh... Oh, dude! Okay, sorry, tell your story and then I'm going to tell you my big disappointment about Zelda Link's Awakening last episode. <laughs> okay. Uh, one time uh, I was playing Cards Against Humanity with uh -huh. uh, Allie, Henry and Cavill? Allie and Kirsten and both of their moms. Yeah. And... Uh, Ali's mom put down a card and it was like, Me hi Hitler. Oh, yeah, I remember that. You, you've literally told <laughs> like, this on the channel. What? Me hi Hitler. It was Mecca Hitler. Yeah. <laughs> you were saying? Uh, so, you remember when we were doing the crane game the one time and I had that thing right near, I think it was the shell I was trying to grab, and it fucking shot out? <laughs> yeah. That video footage blacked out, so we never seen that. Oh, no. Yeah, I was like, it's probably one of the funniest <laughs> things to happen. Damn. On that Let's Play for yeah. sure. Maybe on this channel so far. Yeah. Some people would disagree. That was like, good. I liked... Did you like the title card picture I did, by the way? For Zelda? No, for uh, the live action Halloween thing where we went to get spooky stuff. Wasn't it just the logo? No. It's a picture of my face, like a big picture of my face, and then you holding the Blood of My Enemies cup. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was good. Fucking asshole. <laughs> I love you right in the ass. I love that you can walk and shoot. It makes you feel like such a fucking <coughs> badass. Yeah. Die! Your days are numbered, fuckface. Do you hear vomiting yet? That's a good thing if we hear vomiting. I hear banging. Really? In here? Yeah. It could just be trying to set us up with some spooks. Honestly. That's like the thing about this game. You never know what's important. Yeah. What's not. It's like, is that an important spook? Oh! Hey. Courtyard key. I don't know where the courtyard is, but we got it. Boy, do we. We. I'm wandering around way too fast, I think, and that's why we keep missing stuff. Yeah. <sighs> The camera's so wobbly in this room. Yeah. It, it's, Ooh. it's That's why this game's weird, because it's, like, disorienting with mm -hmm. its camera. It's not like... Like, Resident Evil has the camera like this, too, but never does... This does more cinematic stuff with it that puts oh. you on edge. Yeah, there's something in here. What, is, what the fuck does it say? Fuck. The phone doesn't work, out. Glad I tried clicking that 30 times to find out. Hello? There's footsteps. And static to the right. I see it. Get down. Looks like you're under dead. <laughs> have we not been here yet? No, I'm pretty sure we have. I don't remember that door. Oh, this picture of uh, Dylan and Hitler. Hmm. I like that picture of us. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we didn't get this first aid kit, so we've been here. I fucking skimmed through it. Clearly. No, there's no way we've no. been here. Where is this? On the map? Oh, I didn't look. <laughs> I randomly tried a random door. Huh. Oh, because I probably grabbed the key and just was like, fuck, you got the key. Yeah. Okay, I gotta figure out... Yeah, that was the fire escape key, and you didn't even notice that you got the key. Well, no, okay, I did notice I got a fire escape key, but I thought the fire escape was for a different thing, <laughs> so once I opened it, I was like, time to go. Oh. Uh -huh. Is there anything else in here while we're here? I don't know. 
Yeah, but, but then again, I never think so. Remember that time I went in that room and there was a fucking important key right on the fucking closet, you know? Yeah. Because <laughs> I just like to fuck off when I find... I'm like, oh, a room. Let's not pay attention to the things. Probably somebody seen that in the video and just screaming their yeah. fucking brains out. It's probably me when I'm editing it, yeah. honestly, but still. Because <laughs> to be fair, I do do this when I go in. I'm like, hup, hup. All right, well, I think we got everything. But handgun bullets itself is worth it. You can never have enough bullets. All right, so I want to figure out where the courtyard entrance is. <laughs> I think we can go down this way, honestly. No. Alright, so we got the first floor, which we're not on. The courtyard's there. Oh, right at the fucking beginning. Okay, I know how to get there fast. Okay. So I think there is an exit over here. We got a courtyard key. We're going to go on adventures, baby. I feel like we should have met Eddie by now. Where's Cliffy Goose? Isn't he in the bowling alley? That's not the first place you meet him. You meet him here oh. first, and he's, like, puking in a toilet. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then he's like, oh, the pizza wasn't <clears throat> the good pizza. I had too much pizza, and I'm lactose intolerant. And he, like, is weird, but everybody's fucking weird in this game. Yeah. James is the only normal-ish guy, and he's even weird. But, like, he's so normal that it's weird. Yeah. That's what, like, this, I, I like this game. I don't think, like, people tell me they think this is, like, the scariest game ever, and I do not agree with that. There's nothing, I could, I don't know. Maybe, like, if you played it as a kid when it first came out, yeah, I could see it. okay, but that's, like, nostalgia scare. Yeah, like, there's nothing, like, there are scary features about this game. Like, I'm not going to say this game has nothing scary about it, because it does sure. have freaky things, and it does have scary ideas and elements. Like, and, like, I could see people who were raped or something maybe getting a little bit uneasy about it, because it does really delve into that. Yeah. And people have suicide issues and stuff, because this game also delves into that. But, like, other than people that have, like, actual, like, things that this game would fully affect... Phobias, yeah. Yeah. I don't think it's actually scary. Its atmosphere is scary. I'll give you that. It does have a, a rather frightening atmosphere. But for the most part, it's kind of silly with just a really powerful message. And I think that's why it, its message is so strong, too, is because the, the rest of the tone of the game, to me, personally, is very silly. Like, it's got this, this silly little thing with, like, this, while you're in this creepy world. It's a bunch of silly people. Oops. Oh, shit. Oh, we bumbled down here. Ah, shoot him with my gun. No. That was <laughs> nine bullets total you just wasted. What did I just get? Siamese. No, in the, what was in the baby cart? I just read the word Siamese that probably didn't say Siamese. Alright, we're going to have to check now because Dylan can't read supersonic fast. Oh, snake coin. Ah. So I need one more coin. The lady. Lady! <laughs> Old man, snake, and lady. Actually, there might be four coins because I remember there being a deaf coin. Hmm. But maybe that's just because I'm mixing it up with my D&D &D thing. It's my D&D &D thing, definitely. Well, there are five thing. slots. Yes. But there's only three we need. Should I just bumble back down into that pool? Okay, so we've checked the pool area. This is a nice apartment building, honestly. Like, I'd like to live here. Like, not now. Yeah. But I mean, like, when you know it's not fucking freaky and shitty. Just don't do something bad, and you'll be fine. Like, don't think about cheating on your wife, and you'll be okay. When she's dying of cancer, Dylan. Looking mm. at you, wondering why your wife always left you. I don't what know. What if you're not guilty about all the shitty things you've done? Then you're done? fine. Yeah? Yep. <laughs> so like that's why people say like they w they'd love to see like Punisher go to Silent Hill and it's like why he'd be fine <laughs> he doesn't feel guilty about any of the people that's why I don't like the Daredevil Punisher because he does feel guilty about that shit the Daredevil Punisher yeah did you ever watch the Netflix Punisher series no oh did you watch Netflix Daredevil no that's good I like Netflix Daredevil I don't like Netflix Punisher I like him in the Daredevil season that he's in mm. but then there's a Punisher season and it's like they there's somebody in here. Yeah, my point. Did you see me point the? Do you hear shooting? No, like do you hear? Does it sound like I'm shooting something? Yeah. No. Okay. Does it stop? No. Yeah. I'll get the bullets. Where'd you go, you little fuck? Hey, come here. I'm gonna kick you. Good boy. <laughs> I like how he, like the animation walks, so they stay there when for the kick. Like you're getting it. Yeah. All right. This is a good, proper, creepy room with nothing in it. 
Well, I had handgun bullets, I guess. I guess it had handgun bullets. Yeah. This is why this place, because this place has so many rooms. The hospital's kind of confusing. Actually, no, the hospital's really confusing, actually, now that I think about it. I remember I got kind of stuck in the hospital. We had to cheat a little. That's where me and Emily first cheated. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. Next time, we're going to go somewhere else in the spooky... Probably. Spook fast! <laughs> You guys don't see that, but the Bones, Bones, Jabones, Bones Malone's brother scares Dylan every now and then. Thanks for watching. Bye.